Ladies and gentlemen, dear colleagues, dear students, and of course, dear partners and friends. Earlier this week, it was with great pleasure that I was able to kick off the annual We Connect Week, which we organized together with our sister university, the Université Libre de Bruxelles. This week is part of a larger movement, We Connect Brussels, which celebrates its 50th anniversary this year. The VUB aims to be an urban, engaged university. A university connected to the city, the region and society. For us, Brussels is like a large classroom, a living laboratory. This is reflected in our strong research groups on urban and metropolitan themes, in our soil projects, community-engaged research and learning projects, and, of course, in our We Connect project. In other years, during this We Connect week, every day hundreds of VUB and ULB students would have attended lectures in the context of dozens of courses at locations that are unusual to them, all over the city, in companies, government institutions, cultural centers, hospitals and care institutions, sporting clubs, town halls, public education centers, international institutions or museums. But this year we were forced to change track, but we nevertheless managed to include very exciting activities into the program. I am particularly pleased that even in these not so obvious circumstances, to say the least, teachers and students have given thought to how they could creatively give substance to our ambition to help make a difference in the city. I cannot repeat it enough. Today's societal challenges are such that we have to build bridges and demolish walls. The amb ambition to be an urban university implies that we take responsibility for the city. It implies forging strong links with the community, with the local authorities, with the schools, with the cultural sector, with the socio-economic actors and stakeholders. We want to contribute to an urban network in which companies, civil society, the government and universities are permanently interconnected. This We Connect Week is part of that. Today we are the guests of one of those partners, the PNV Foundation. The mission of the PNV Foundation is to nurture a sense of social responsibility in young people and to promote active participation in the building of an inclusive society. The actions and operations of the PNV Foundation are based around four principles, inspired by values associated with the social economy. Solidarity, empowerment, citizenship and participation. In this way, it intends to support active citizenship and to fight against social marginalization of young people. The VUB can look back on a very fruitful and long-term cooperation with the PNV Foundation. They are, among other things, a strong and engaged supporter of We Connect Brussels. And I am very happy that they were willing to host today's masterclass on Wat El Kateab. On Wednesday, December 2nd, 2020, the PNV Foundation awarded its 16th Citizenship Award to Wat El Kateab. The Citizenship Award is an annual award conferred to a person, initiative or organization of Belgian or international origin whose activity has shown exemplary commitment to promoting an open, democratic and tolerant society. The prize will be awarded during Difference Day on May 2nd this year. Born in 1991 in Syria, Wat El Katiab is a journalist, a filmmaker and an activist. Her last name is a pseudonym invented to protect her family when she started filming the war in 2011. In 2009, she moved to Aleppo to study economics at Aleppo University, 
but her studies were, unfortunately and dramatically, interrupted by the revolution and the war which followed. She has reported on the war for Channel 4 News for five years. She won an International Emmy Award for her reports inside Aleppo. Since 2016, she has been living and working in Great Britain, where she fled with her family. She made her film debut in For Sama with Edward Watts. It won the Golden Eye Award for Best Documentary at the Cannes Film Festival in 2019. It is also the most nominated documentary in the history of the British Academy Film Awards. On November 23, in 2020, she won an Emmy Award for Best Documentary. In a moment, I will leave the floor to my colleagues Tim Raats, Kevin Smets, Jan Loazen and Yassan Badran, who can undoubtedly tell you a lot more about her. But before I do that, I would like to thank all the teachers and the assistants who responded so enthusiastically to the call to participate in this very special We Connect Week. I would like to thank the many institutions that helped to find ways to set up activities together in these unusual and very unusual circumstances. I would of course also like to thank our partners today, the PNV Foundation. And I would also like to thank our sponsors, Innoviris, the VGC and the Humanistisch Verbond. I would like to thank the various services of the VUB who have helped to make all this possible. In particular, IRMO, our international service, and AVE services. I would also like to thank our fellows and alumni who helped establish contacts with the partners. Finally, and of course, I would like to thank the students for actively participating in this very special week. Next year, I promise, the We Connect Week will once again be organized in real life in the heart of the city. This will undoubtedly be an extremely interesting week and it will not stop at this week. We will never let go of Brussels. Wishing you a very pleasant workshop.